Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to start a single player survival world. First you'll need to create your world, I will call mine double O for some reason. Now I press enter and my world will be starting to build. <coughs> okay, now I have spawned near trees luckily. And first, obviously, I am just going to break the wood. So, today, all I'm going to do is show you how to build a house and survive the first couple of days, really. So, after you've got quite a bit of wood, you'll just need to put it in there, and then you get this. You press shift and click on it and then it will go down here. Then you right click on all the boxes and you get a crafting table which you can just put down and then make sticks which help you make swords which you can kill animals with and you can make axes which cut down trees quicker and I will just go cut down some trees. When you make uh, items like swords and pickaxes and shovels and axes and stuff, you can make them out of stone, um, iron, gold and diamond. The diamond is the rarest and yeah I'm just gonna get a bit, quite a bit of wood and then I will just go show you how to start on a house. Okay now I am going to run to the shoreline just around here because there is usually more flat land around there. This is actually enough flat ground. So I like to put patterns in my house. So I am just going to just going to take this tree down. Luckily I just got an apple and you can eat apples to keep your health going and you have to eat otherwise your health will go down and you can die oops that's the wrong spot so right now i am just doing the outside of my house and to build is left click and to break is right click That works pretty well. And now I am just going to place my crafting table there and then make this into wooden planks and place my wooden planks in the middle of each of these. Now, later on, you are going to need coal to make torches and you can also make charcoal but right now oh um, some sugar cane I will just go quickly get this uh, to get sugar cane you just need to hit the bottom and the rest of it will fall down and with sugar cane you can make sugar cane farms which I'll show you to do how to do later. And also cactus you can make farms with. You can use it to protect your house, which I am going to do maybe later though. Let's get some. So cactus look works just like um, sugar cane. And now I am just going to make a pick. And with that pick, I will get some stone. And I just found some.
some sandstone, which is helpful for houses. And I am very lucky that I found it, because then obviously it will help me with my house. Man, there's quite a lot of it. Okay, now for the bit that I came here for, the sand, the cobblestone. Cobblestone, all you have to do is go down and you will run into it. Pretty easy to find. And sand will fall down the same as gravel. So, let's get a bit more. Okay, now I am going to go back up. Oops. Okay, now I have got cobblestone which I will just put around my inventory to make a furnace and a furnace you can use to make glass if you get some sand But now I will just have to make some charcoal, which I will show you how to make after I have got some more wood. That's just about enough. Now I will click there and do that, and it will start making charcoal. Now I'll just quickly get some more wood to make a bit more wooden planks so I'll get a bit more charcoal. Now as you can see I have charcoal. And now you can use the charcoal to put around your house with the sand and do different things with it. So now I'm just going to decorate my house a little bit more. I want to put some sandstone. I think sandstone is, makes a very good look. I think it's a very good item, block, whatever you want to call it. So just surrounding my house or I'll just have an off. <coughs> and now making a bit of charcoal I've got 13 sand I might just get a couple more As you can see there's a lot of cacti over there I might go and get some and make a kind of like a farm around my house so they can't just come up and just kill me at night so I'm gonna put um charcoal in so the charcoal lasts a lot longer now I've got to put a space for a door Doors are very, very easy to make. You just go down and down. Get the door and use it. Now I've got a working door. I I might go and try and find some food. Maybe a little bit more.